Look at this guy I found over here. Who's this guy? What's up, YouTube? Made it. What is going on, guys? Cody here, vegetarian gains. But I'm riding solo today. Uh, it's a gorgeous Sunday. Uh, happy Easter to everybody who's watching. I know this will be a, a day or two down the road, but I really want to take advantage of this alone time that I have. Uh, Nobody is on campus. Everybody's probably at home. Obviously, I wish I could be at home, but you know, I went home last weekend and I got a huge week coming up with work. And with that, I always wait till the weekends to do my homework. So, you know, got to do what you got to do. But once I get that piece of paper in May, it'll all be worth it. But uh, I just want to do a check-in video here. I know the title of this will probably be something like chest and triceps and put that footage at the end of the video because I know most people don't like to watch that all that much. But, you know, I was able to sneak into any time today with my other roommate and we're able to film there so the lighting in there like for camera wise isn't good but I'm telling you it's like stage lighting it puts like 10 pounds of muscle on you I swear to god but wanted to check in with you guys um, my very first video I used the personal trainer scale at the gym that I work at and it came up with three different weights and the one I put on I think was 222 now, I'm gonna start just using the scale that's in our apartment. It's obviously lower. So this week I had a 213 weigh-in. Now, I don't know, I'll be honest, I don't know which one of those is closer. I hope it's not the 221, but we're just gonna keep using that one. So right now, 213. But who cares about that? Uh, the weights on the scale, not what counts at all. It's how you look and how you feel. So. Just want to check in with you guys. If you're new to the channel, I have been eating vegetarian, lacto, vegetarian for uh, nine weeks now. This Sunday will be nine weeks. And, you know, I started out just as like a joke. Um, you know, I've always had a chip on my shoulder with stuff like proving people wrong. And I just hate how much the bro scientists talk about protein. How much protein you need? Two grams per pound of body weight? I mean, that's nuts. No offense, but that's nuts. As a natural lifter, which as you can see how tiny I am, definitely natty, uh, only half natty in the certain lighting. But there's there's no way that a normal human needs that much protein. There's not, you're not gonna digest it. There's no freaking way. Um, the FDA tells us that, the nutritionists at my school tell us that. You know, so I started out just eating oatmeal for dinner instead of my normal chicken or whatever but I've actually really grown to like it and I just kind of wanted to check in tell you guys how I thought you know and I actually really like it it's weird I know um, but I feel great all my clothes are fitting you know way better um, I always have kind of a big waist and leg days treated me well so I don't know how much my waist size is gonna shrink, but my clothes just fit way better. My dress clothes are way too big now, which is sweet. In a way, it's cool. Another way, I gotta spend some more money, but you know, if you've ever thought about it, I say just try it. Try for a week, try for a couple days. Um, you know, for me, it was just a way to eat some healthier foods along the way and a way to easily cut out calories. Cause there's, I mean, there's nothing wrong with meat, like calorically. But it's been a way for me to eat more of the foods that I personally enjoy and a way for me to cut out calories pretty easily. So cutting chronicles wise, how much weight am I down? Uh, like I said, I'm not entirely sure. and There's no way I've lost 10 pounds, <laughs> but I would be willing to say I've lost 10 to 15 pounds since I started eating vegetarian. So we're gonna roll with that. Um, I think we're six weeks away from graduation five or six that's scary for one but two <clears throat> time for me to kind of step up uh, like I said in earlier videos I've always told myself that I would try to put on as much quality muscle as I could while I was at school and then when it was time for me to get it done 
I gotta do it. Last thing I wanna talk about, before we throw that workout footage on there, then you guys subscribe. Um, you know, this uh, the end of this week, me and Cam, we, uh, you know, we didn't like pig out, pig out. I mean, I can, you know if I pigged out, I wouldn't be scared to tell you that. But on Thursday, we made a Chipotle run, got the whole nine yards, chips, bowl. And we always go to Fresh Time grocery store and we always get an everything cookie. And I can't tell you how much calories are in that, but that whole meal is about 1,500 calories probably. Maybe the Sofri does help me out a little bit because I don't get double chicken. I don't get any kind of servings anymore, or double servings anymore, sorry. But that was going to be like our refeed day. And then Friday, I don't even remember what I ate Friday. But then yesterday, I did the same thing again. So I just kind of want to touch base with you guys because in my adventures, you know, I've always I had a lot of people ask me, you know, how to lose weight and stuff. And one thing I can tell you that is so overrated is just messing up on your diet because so many people including myself have done that like oh man you know I shouldn't have had those chips at Chipotle probably shouldn't have had that cookie yesterday but you know what it happened I ate it so what do you do next do you go and get that blizzard that I want right now <laughs> do you go and be like oh man I, I got I got too many drinks in me on Saturday, so Sunday's a wash. I'll start over Monday. All that is is lost time. Okay, for one, your body has no idea what day of the week it is. Just check in, make sure I don't get smacked while I'm talking to you guys. That'd be funny though, wouldn't it? But you know, it's not like, oh man, reset on Monday. Like, no, no. reset right there. Chipotle chips are one of my weaknesses. It's like 500 calories per bag. I know that would give or take who's making the bag, I guess. But, you know what, I ate it, I did. But then that rest of that day, you control what you put into your body. That's one of the few things in life that we do control. So, next time you slip up, don't let it wreck you. Don't let it ruin your whole week. You know, if you go out with your friends on Thirsty Thursday, don't wait till Monday to get back on the horse. Start as soon as you're done. Make sure you try to keep things in check, keep them in control, because you can have fun and live life, still get healthier, still lose those pounds. So, to wrap it up, hope you guys have a good rest of your day, good rest of your holiday. Uh, throw down some ham for me, because God knows I can't. And, uh, and check out the chest and tricep workout footage. My uh, my split has been chest try, shoulders by, back, legs, rest when needed, and then I repeat for chest and try, back, and then uh, shoulders and, and, and biceps. Sorry, it's a lot of steps going on. <laughs> it's hard to keep track of. I'm doing the Arnold Schwarzenegger rep range from um, his blueprint. So that's 30. So that's 30, 12, 10, 8, 6. Uh, you can check out a sample workout. The only thing that's missing is some flat dumbbell presses, but my cameraman kind of zoned out. But you know what flat presses look like. So if you like this video, give it a like. Um, subscribe. More videos coming up as we get more lean and get deeper into it. So thank you guys for watching. Enjoy the workout footage. Have a good rest of your day.
Thank you.